laughing behind the camera. Anyways, welcome to my video. Today I'm going to be an unbagging slash unboxing some stuff I ordered online and to show you all the things I bought in the last couple of weeks. So start off with starting off with this ridiculous magenta suit. <laughs> so I bought this from Portman's. I saw it on the rack at uh, the front of the store and I'm like, I'm gonna try that on for fun. Little did I know, I'm like, I love it and it's not ridiculously priced. What the hell, I'll just get it for fun. So here it is. So you would have seen me in the walk-in. It's a um, slightly wide-legged pants uh, and like blazer, long style jacket. And it's double breasted here. And it's a bit of fun. So it's satiny. Uh, not much stretch in it at all. And I guess the waist comes up to here. And I'm just wearing a slip dress so I can try on the stuff for you so you can have a look. So this is the first item and then uh, let's start unbagging this one. So I'm pretty sure this is a jacket uh, that I ordered. What's funny is I saw all these things um, <clears throat> in person as I was wandering the shops after I ordered it. I actually ordered it as a part of Quick Frenzy and I wasn't sure if the discounts were going to persist after that day so uh yeah so my friend who's a stylist um i helped her kind of practice her shopping and styling on me and she pointed out this jacket and i was really surprised because how do i open it <laughs> i had tried this jacket on before in different colors uh, like purple pink uh, i've even tried it in a light blue but I didn't think to try uh, on in this kind of color. This is a camel color from Marks. And I tried it on and I'm like, hey, this works. And I usually don't gravitate towards this kind of stuff much because it's kind of boring, but it worked and I was very surprised. So I'm glad she was able to show me this. So this is a felt jacket. So this was on sale and I had to order in my size. And, okay, let's put this on. It's getting warm now. All right, so, I know, where do I put my things? <laughs> Thank you, assistant, behind the camera. So this is a zip. So this style has, has been around for a while. Um, but yeah, like I said, I never tried it on in this particular color. And I have no idea what I look like until I watch the playback. But yeah. So I tried this size on in a different colour and I knew that it was a better size for me than what was available. If I can zip this up. Do 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 do. So it's a good neutral colour and it's soft. It's got some ribbing in the underarm. I think to protect it from wearing out as much. Uh, so that's what it looks like. And you can zip it up like this as well. <laughs> so that's one. And then next item is a jacket I bought from Zara. So you might have seen in my last video, I had a, uh, I bought a blazer from them, kind of tweedish style that is in a similar cut so they have quite a few of these uh as are at the moment in different colors so this is black and white and that's what it looks like up close some buttons so i'll quickly put that on you can see what it looks like <laughs> there we go double breasted you can button the last button That looks like on me. It comes up to here, just below the hips. So there's another one. Next <laughs> um, is a cardigan I've also bought from Zara. So this one is covered in tinsel and there's some silver, some pink, 
Uh, the tinsel is gold and there's some kind of light cream um, mixed in it. Very European vibes. So the the tinsel is a tiny bit scratchy, but I figured for winter I'll wear a long sleeve in there. But right now I don't mind. Um, so there's no fastener, no button. Uh, and there's a weird thing going on on the side. Um, so what I'm going to do is actually close this up a bit. So it doesn't have the kind of round edges. So I, I knew I was going to do that when I bought it. So that's what... It looks like a bit twinkly for winter kind of thing. And that's the sleeve. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Next up. Oh no. It's stuck because the tag's still on it. <laughs> okay. So next one is a cardigan I bought from Witchery. So they have a few colors in this. This was the brightest. There's some blues, really light pinks, um, maybe a cream, I can't remember. So this, this has no fastener, no button, but I like this because there's kind of like a defined colour thing if you allow it. So it's cut at the back and <laughs> yeah, so it just creates some definition and it frames the face. So. This red is funny. I, I really like this red and I think the red suits me, but it's I'm struggling to match it with some other colors at the moment. So I'm wearing it with basic colors, so you know, black, white. So this wraps around, it can wrap around like this. And I think I might actually wear it with a belt and just kind of have it like a knitted dress. So that's what that looks like. So it's roomy. Okay, next up. What do I do? <laughs> um, I'm gonna have to clean up this mess later. Okay, next item. I think this is a top. And scissors, top, top, top. I'm gonna have to clean up this mess later. <laughs> So this is a black top from Revenue and my stylist friend picked this out for me and she did so well because she was able to tune into my aesthetic and I've done styling before so I used to style people too, not so much anymore but it's really good to see a new perspective um, so I was actually very impressed that uh, she was able to pick out things I liked and I'm even more surprised because I'm quite a picky shopper. <laughs> So she was up for the challenge and good on her. So she's just starting out. Okay, so this is a top with a, it's like a crew neck. And I wouldn't have picked this out myself, mainly because on the hanger, the sleeves don't look that exciting. But when I put it on, I actually really like the sleeves. So they're kind of old school. There's a velvet ribbon there, there's spots and it's pleated and this is mesh. And this is a bit stretch, stretchy. Put it on you. That's what that looks like. And then what else do I have? I actually have another top from Forever New. Oh, taking clothes off is so much easier than <laughs> putting one. Okay, so this is another one as well. Hope my hair is okay. Um, so this full on sequin with slightly balloony sleeves and what I realized was I actually don't have that many fancy black tops to wear with some of the nice skirts I have. Ow! <laughs> so this is round, round neck as well. There's a button at the back. But yeah, it's very glam and then I'll wear it kind of like inside a skirt for instance. Like that. Shiny, shiny! Your button has to be up at the back. But yeah, it's a loose fit and it's a slight stretch to it as well. Okay, what's next? <laughs> okay, last 
package for me to open. Can you guess what it is? Let me know. Could be anything. I like to think I am predictably unpredictable. <laughs> okay. So, there's two items in here. Next item is a skivvy. So this is from Portman's. So I did try this on in person. And I think it's a nice colour. Uh, I don't have any really coloured skivvies. This is what it looks like. Oh, I try it on fine. <laughs> it's getting warm. Oh no! <laughs> I'm stuck. Okay, so as you can see, there's two layers to this top. This is a ribbed skivvy and it's actually not too thick. The colour's still cute. What colour is this? They call it cotton candy. And it has nice button detail here. Let me get it on. Alright. <laughs> entertainment for ya. Yeah, so it's kind of thin. Like, not super thin, but like medium thin. So it'd be nice to wear under something. So I'm wearing my slip dress underneath. But yeah, there's some kind of matte, big gold buttons on the sleeve. Okay, no, nothing too fancy. And then, what else have I got? So I bought this. This is um, from, I actually bought it from the Max Mara outlet, but it's Marina Rinaldi and it's wool. And it's a, I guess it's like a pleated knit skirt, but the pleat changes the size as it goes down. So I'm just going to chuck this on over everything for you. So I'm still wearing my suit pants. So this is nice for winter. I've actually got a lot of summery things. So I've got a thing for vertical textures, if you haven't noticed. Um, and this is what the skirt looks like with my pants. I just, this got three colours, don't, don't look too bad together. <laughs> so it's up to just above my ankle. And yeah, so it's nice, thickish to wear in winter. And then, my husband's trying to tell me something, but I can't read it. You have fluff in your hair. I have fluff in my hair. <laughs> I got a lot of baby hairs. Okay. Uh, okay. What next? <laughs> so there's quite a few still to go, and they're all kind of long pieces. So, uh, all right. So the garment hiding in the bag is this. So I actually tried this on. I saw it on the hanger in the store, but I didn't try it on. I ordered it then went to try it. So it should be the right size. Okay, so it's like a semi to a neck long sleeve pleated look-ish dress. Surprise! I'm in my dress magically! the powers of video editing okay so this dress comes up to my ankle and it's kind of flared out like this so the texture changes here I don't know what this is called actually short turtleneck long sleeve knitted a bit stretchy back. so I like the texture and the verticals so that's what I'm about lately because a lot of my other things are kind of flat colored and then next I have another purple dress <laughs> so this is one prop ones by the way the one I'm wearing this is from I bought it from Maya and the brand is Elliot and I, I've been vibing kind of roughly floral things I actually did a Pinterest style board and I've 
I actually pinned a lot of fluffy, not fluffy, um, ruffly things, but like kind of big, uh, exaggerated ruffles. So, <laughs> try an Instagram trick. <laughs> okay, after much struggle, I finally got this dress on. And this is what it looks like. And this is a similar purple to the dress I had before. What's funky and different about this is that the bottom is asymmetrical. It's like, yeah, so it looks like that. But it's longer over here. And then the back. And the elastic here is slightly stretchy. Okay, next try on. Hello again! <laughs> this is so unco, I haven't really done a video like this before. So, uh, I'm wearing a jumpsuit. It's black from Veronica Main. Uh, and it's the legs are really wide, see? And I have to wear heels with this. But I like this because it has the skirt effect and you know the flow effect. And it has pockets! And then it's got a, a, an included fabric belt. And it actually loops through this gap here, and I can change up the belt if I want to. So what? So what? <laughs> okay, next one. And this is the second last dress I bought from Chic. Chic. I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> so this is a balloony sleeve. So I actually like this. I think because there's kind of movement. And you know, there's this playfulness, but um, this is like a, oh, it's like a, I'd say it's like a plum, dark plum color, and it's like a slightly stretchy, slinky material. So one sleeve, and there's a cutout here, and it falls up to my ankles. <laughs> um, and there's a massive cutout theme going on. Um, in a lot of new fashion today and it's so annoying because what about when the fashion trend fades what do you do so with this one I thought about it though and once the cutout phase is over I can actually raise this and then it won't actually look wrong at the bottom um, so yeah I can close up this stitch and then it still looks kind of level here I'm gonna wear this on date nights all right, finale dress. Yo, yo! <laughs> My husband's laughing. Okay, so I've just been told I look kind of like the Matrix. <laughs> so I'm wearing this, um, it's mostly like a black mesh with uh, green kind of stripes. <laughs> yeah, green pin stripes throughout, so it's a bit metallic-y. Uh, so it's long sleeve, and yes, there's cutouts, but I accept these cutouts for what they are. Probably could modify, I haven't thought about it that far. But it's long, uh, it's lined here and here. Um, it's, let's see, probably need to wear a little bit of heel. What the back look like? Slightly puffy shoulder. Shoulder pads? It's like there's a layer of weird padding here. But yeah, it's OTT. I tried it on for fun and I didn't expect to actually like it that much. But yeah, it's me again with my. I like green and I like vertical textures. And I didn't really have a glamorous dress that wasn't necessarily a ball gown. So this is a fun addition. But yeah, let me know what you think of my haul. Let me know if you have any questions. It's a bit of fun. Hopefully the edit isn't too unco. Follow me, like the video for good luck. Subscribe for lots of money. And I'll see you next time. Bye.